What is going on everyone? Welcome back into Road Graders. I'm your guy Cole Jackson brought to you today by the Russell Street Report. Be sure to check out RussellStreetReport.com to get ready for this Sunday's matchup with the Houston Texans. Friday, go check out Battle Plans. It's their weekly preview article. It's going to be fascinating, always well written, always exciting, and helps you get ready. And today we are going to be getting ready for Sunday, talking about a very, very interesting rookie, and that is the Houston Texans' Will Anderson Jr., a guy that after they took C.J. Stroud second overall, they traded a first and a second in the 2023 draft and a 2024 first and third, if I recall correctly, to go get the outside linebacker out of Alabama. And he only played 25 snaps in the preseason. I went back through them, and I was pretty impressed. And this is a guy that, um, you know, from the snaps I could see, he's going to be number 51. You'll see him circled here um, in this clip, but a lot of his snaps came against the right tackle for the Ravens. That's going to be Morgan Moses. And he, Will Anderson's your your straight up speed rusher. He's a guy that can wreck games. He did it a ton at Alabama and you know, he's a rookie. Um, not trying to give him his flowers before they're earned, but you're going to kind of see as we look at his preseason, what he could do to impact the Ravens. Um, so we're going to look at some of his pass rushes. I threw, I think I threw him one run D snap um, and kind of just get ready to see what the rookie's going to bring. Um, this is a really interesting snap, though. I want you guys, I'm going to show two things. Obviously, we're going to break down Anderson um, out here as a wide tech on the right side of your screen, but also Denzel Perryman in the middle here and a little bit of D'Amico Ryans and what he can do um, with the creativity. Um, so let's run it through, and then we'll go back and break down how they got this sack. Um, so what we see here, um, you got D'Amico as the, the Mike linebacker. He's up here mugging the A gap against the center and then as the snap comes you see him turn to go bail out and as he does the center turns his eyes inside because he thinks he's bailing out and what does he do well you got single block here single block here their center that's David Andrews their starter he thinks his reps over against Perriman well he curls back watch boom and then he takes off to go get that sack but um you know, just to be clear, the right tackle here, I don't even know who he is. I don't think he made the team. Uh, this is just an ugly snap. He played inside leverage against uh, the 4 I tech here when it's like he forgot um, that he had an outside linebacker out here. So as the snap comes off, you see what characterizes Will Anderson, quick off the ball, explosive, and there's just not enough set in the vertical set here. You can see his hands up there given help. They're kind of doubling uh, the four tech and he's not getting out to will anderson um, but this is the thing about will anderson he's explosive he's fast and he'll make you pay if you make a mistake like that so he doesn't end up making the play but boy was he close and it shows that explosiveness here we get into a snap um, he's gonna be on the left side of your screen here again against the right tackle against the dolphins let's run it through and we're gonna see something like the ball comes out quick it's not a sack it's not a pressure but first off before we get into it i just want you guys to see how quick he comes off the ball who's up first he's these guys aren't even out of their stance yet <laughs> they still got hands in the dirt and there's anderson already coming out um, so that's kind of one of his big traits and there you see him try and create a little bit of space he uses that inside arm hooks up in pushes out and this is, this is where I wonder with Morgan Moses if he's going to see a lot of him. Um, you know, Moses in those vertical sets, he wants to get his hands on guys and lean guys down. But Anderson here is able to use his hands, create separation, and then he uses that right arm. So he just long-armed, create separation, then he's going to try and rip that under. And you see him right there. You see that right arm coming up as he tries to bend the corner. Um, and so that's where... You know, the question is, what's Morgan Moses got to do in this matchup if that's where he's going to line up? And he's got to be able to ride his hip, just like the right tackle did in this clip. So he's got to ride his hip, and as he bends, push him out the back of the pocket, just like he did here. So just out the back of the pocket like that. Um, really nice snap from that right tackle, but it shows the, the snap quickness, um, the ability to bend, and the ability to use a power move, 
followed by a finesse move. He's got the whole thing in his bag. Um, this is going to be, uh, this is a little bit of a, you know, I don't want to gloat too much for him about this play because he goes unblocked, but he does get a, he gets a sack fumble. He runs over the running back. Let's run it through. And he just blows up that running back. Um, so again, let's watch his quickness off the snap as the ball comes out. He's already working up field, working up field. He's cutting inside here. I like that because he identified he's got a puller going away from him. He had a motion man right here. Tackle's looking inside, so he cuts the inside zone. He, he's probably expecting a run play here, um, and it's a play action. It's a high snap, too, just for context. Um, but the way he just blows up that running back and then gets his hands and closes, right? And so, you know, that high snap followed by getting blown up like that just causes the fumble. And so that's the type of, you know, game-changing play he can make on a moment's notice. We get in back into a play against the Patriots here. We're going to see him run a little bit of a stunt. Again, not anything special. You know, I was <laughs> clipping off of uh, 25 total snaps, so, you know, I just wanted to kind of show some things. But here we're going to see a little stunt game. Um, I think that's it's Rankins. Yeah, Rankins is going to go up, try and occupy that B gap, create a little bit of a loop. And it's just more the speed that he has um, to kind of bend and get around. And then, like you see right here at the end, He's got, uh, he's got 66 beat when he comes around. And, you know, the ball comes out, but his hand's right there. He's bending him. So if the ball didn't come out, you know, he's got to play on him. So it's just another thing to keep an eye on that the Ravens will have to deal with. Um, here we have him in a little bit tighter, and this is where, um, you know, he makes a difference in the run game. So they're going to run um, what looks like a duo concept here. So you get the doubles inside against uh, the defensive tackle. So there's your, your double teams in the duo. And Anderson, who I think has been mostly labeled as, and he's lined up as a five-tech here, mostly labeled as a finesse guy, but here you see that inside move and just the quickness, the explosiveness runs right through the arm, right into the backfield, finishes. Um, that's something that is going to make a difference. And so the question is, what does Morgan Moses need to do? This was one of the snaps where I thought he, he had a loss, and I want to take a look at what works so well for the offensive tackle. He is playing a little bit of low gear here for context. He's not trying to bend him. But the difference is what we saw in those previous snaps was vertical sets, right, where quick steps back. This is where we're going to see basically a jump set where he's lined up as a five tech. And you see right there, see that first step going out laterally. It's not even a 45. It's a quick set right out onto him. You see him lock in the hands, nice, strong inside hands. There's our back arc that we want to see. Low butt that he can get down and engage. Again, I think Will Anderson's in a low gear snap here, um, but this is what the Ravens tackles will need to do. Now you'll notice on this snap, you got a wide tech on this side, but Will Anderson's a lot closer here. On some of those old other snaps, he was a lot wider. So I'm expecting the Texans to come out in these wide techs and really attack the edges um, against Ronnie Stanley and Morgan Moses. So how they kind of prepare and get ready for that is going to be interesting but it's going to be a big test um, for the Ravens in their first game going against an athletic stud or rookie is yeah he's a rookie I get it um, but you know he's a guy that can make plays he can get the ball out um, it's going to be interesting so that's all I have for you guys be good to yourselves be good to each other peace out